first one must be nice to have a, a run of games in the first thing. Yeah, it's good. It's a real confidence booster for me, uh, especially when we get a few wins uh, under his belt. And you know, that's what I need really. I'm, uh, I need a good run of games to uh, build confidence in myself and you know get that match fitness needed. And you know, it's it's paying off, and I'm enjoying rugby at the moment. I can imagine it's been a frustrating time over the past couple of years, but I guess you've got to take the opportunity once it comes to you. Yeah, I've uh, I've been waiting patiently for my time. Um, and when it comes, I'm, I'm grabbing it with both hands and, you know, trying to go out on the field and, and put in the best performance I can. You know, it's not going to happen every week, but, you know, I'm putting uh, 100% in every time I walk out onto that field. You obviously came back into the side on the wing. You were back at full-back uh, at the moment with uh, the injuries in the half. Actually, obviously much more comfortable at full-back, but how did you find things on the wing? Yeah, it's, uh, I've got a lot of respect for wingers. You know, it's, uh, it's a really difficult position to play. It's, uh, you know, some really tough reads and, and tough carries in, in yardage and stuff, but... You know, I don't really mind where I play, to be honest. As as long as I'm out on that field playing, I, you know, I'll play anywhere. But obviously, my uh, preferred position is fullback. But you know, if it's uh, it's only it's only making me a better player. You know, it's a, another position I can play. Um, you know, moving on in my career. So it's you know, like I said, it, I'm happy to play anywhere, half back, centre. You know, as long as I'm out on that field playing, I'm I'm not really bothered. Was there any any thoughts that you might have to leave to get more regular game time? Um, yeah, well, yeah, we had a bit of discussion uh, with my agent and stuff, you know, maybe looking at going loan, but, you know, with, with the team we've got, if if uh, one of us half-backs did go down injured, then, you know, it's it's straight coming to the team. So, you know, I'm, I'm happy to buy my time and, you know, play uh, play rugby here, but, you know, if, if it did come to that, that decision, I'd have to go uh, out on loan elsewhere somewhere. It's it's fine by me as long as I'm playing, but, you know, I'd, I prefer to be playing at Wakefield. You mentioned uh, there's been injuries you've come into the side because of that, but the team seems to be still playing with with the same spirit, and, and I guess that says something about the squad that's been built here. Yeah, definitely. Over you know when when Chesley took over, and you know Brian did a, a, some good recruiting as well, and you know we've uh, we've built on that. We've got a really strong squad now. It, I think it shows you know the uh, the amount of injuries we've got. You know a lot of a lot of main players with Bruffy and Milky and Tom and Bill. It's you know, it shows we've got a really strong uh, strong squad and a lot of depth for them players to come through and, you know, still play with a lot of spirit and, you know, get the wins. Nice to get a try as well against Leeds on Monday. It's always nice to get a try against uh, against anybody, but yeah, especially against Leeds at home to uh, get a good good double against them is always nice. You got Hull this week, played them a few weeks ago and beat them at the KCOM. You're going there again. Is it is it an advantage to have played them so recently and, and know the kind of form they're in? Yeah, I think you know they'll uh, they'll be coming out uh, to this game with a with a strong team. Uh, you know they'll be wanting to improve on uh, their performance uh, over Easter, especially against St. Helens. So I think they'll come out firing, and you know we uh, we need to match that, especially uh, in that first twenty minutes. I think they'll they'll come out of the blocks really hard. So I think you know we'll get into that arm wrestle and uh, give them a good performance. You obviously had the narrow defeat at Catswood, then the narrow win over Leeds, but they've had two completely opposite performances, beating Hull KR by plenty and then losing by plenty away since. Yeah, I think it, it shows this season that you know anybody can beat anybody by how many points. But you know it's, it, we're disappointed one at Cass. I think you know we we can't go out and give uh, give teams, especially like Cass. Uh, a 22 point start but it shows how uh, how good of a team we've got to come out of that second half and you know almost nick it at the end but yeah I think the uh, boys are really enjoying playing rugby at the minute and you know it shows that on that field and I guess as you say they'll be looking to bounce back from that defeat against some Helms but they've got some quality players all over the field yeah I think they rested a couple for that game but you know they'll they'll uh, they'll have a really strong side but you know even with our injuries we've we've still got a really strong side and you know we're we're looking to get them two points to uh, budge up that ladder more.